Good morning everyone. So today is going to be an interesting day because I got literally no sleep last night. And when I say literally, I don't mean like, oh my gosh, literally, I mean like I, I literally didn't sleep last night. Not because I didn't try. I laid my head down at midnight. I was sure of that because I knew I had to go to work at 8 o'clock in the morning today. And I knew I'd want sleep. So I made sure that I was in bed. But I just could not fall asleep. Do you, am I the only one that has these nights where you just like lay in bed and you're just like, please, please, I will give anything. Just let me sleep right now because I'm so tired. Please. That was me last night. I was like willing to sacrifice my first child. And now I have to go pull a seven hour shift where I'm going to be on my feet the whole time. It's going to be interesting. That's for dang sure. So I'm going to be there early. I'm going to be tired the whole dang time. I'm going to be having to fight sleep. I'm hoping that actually since I'm on my feet the whole shift that I won't like be tempted to fall asleep because if I was like at a desk, I'm sure that I would just be like, like nodding off the entire time. So I am very much, I'm crossing my fingers that me being on my feet will help me not just nod off and fall asleep on my feet which I have done before so we're gonna hope that this is not one of those times I'm not that tired I don't think so hopefully so I just passed by a billboard that was advertising one of those like TV and internet sensor uh, things where it like automatically censors the curse words and all of the graphic scenes and stuff and I thought it was interesting because they were advertising it with the Game of Thrones as an example. What is Game of Thrones without the graphic violence and cursing? Like, that's what half the people that watch Game of Thrones watch it for. I thought that was an interesting choice. Like, of all the things they could have possibly advertised that next to, to make it of all the TV shows they would try to make family friendly they picked Game of Thrones am I the only one that finds that weird or there is there like a really big market that I'm just not aware of that like of people that really want to watch Game of Thrones but really don't want to see the graphic violence really don't want to hear any curse words and I'm assuming they also censor out all the sex scenes because that's also a thing in Game of Thrones and if you can't watch gore I'm assuming you don't want to watch sex scenes either is there like a market for that that I'm just not aware of? Because that seems like a weird TV show to want to watch if that's what you don't want to watch. Because there's nothing left to watch. Very little anyway. I mean, even if you did just want strictly plot and you didn't want to deal with any of the violence, any of the sex scenes, any of the cuss words, anything like that, in Game of Thrones, like, important plot points are shoved right in those gore scenes and right in those sex scenes. Like, that's where you find out some important stuff most of the time because they know that's the only reason they'll keep a lot of people interested. I'm not saying everyone, just a fair chunk of people. Also, I totally read the schedule wrong. I'm not a half hour early. I'm an hour and a half early. My coworker who has the key isn't even here yet. So I get to chill outside, probably looking at Tumblr for the next like half hour until he gets here. Oh, never mind, he's here early. Okay guys, so I just got home from work. It is six o'clock and I am exhausted. Not because I work very hard at work. I mean, I got the stuff done that I needed to, but like, it's not like it was physically intense or anything. I just, I can't go this long without sleep. I was nodding off during my shift, which is bad. So what I'm going to try to do right now is I'm going to try, try to take like a short nap, like less than an hour right now, because I do have things that I want to get done today, uh, but like they're like things that require intellectual uh I can't word. I, I'm tired. I can't word. Uh, they're things that like require your brain to function and be intelligent. 
Uh, and right now, I clearly can't do that. My brain is gone. It fell asleep a long time ago, apparently. Uh, so... I'm gonna try and take, with me, like, a quick nap. And then... I'm gonna hopefully get up, get some things done. And then... Then, tonight, hopefully I'll still be tired enough to go to bed on time. So... That's what we're gonna try, anyway. Wish me luck. Fingers crossed. I may have overshot it a little bit. Uh, I woke up at one o'clock in the morning. You know, rather than that, like, hour nap I said I was gonna try and... No, that didn't happen. But, thankfully, none of the stuff I had to get done was, like, necessary. Like, I have to be get it done. Sorry, my hair is just doing the loveliness thing, but... I can't be bothered to fix it right now. Um, none of the stuff, like, had to be done by, like, midnight or anything like that. Uh, it's just stuff that I'd very much like to get done at some point in my life. But, anyway, in an attempt to be functional tomorrow, I'm going to eat something because I'm starving and then just go back to bed and see if I can't just oversleep instead. I don't know. I don't know what to do in this situation because I don't want to stay up because then I'll be just super tired tomorrow and just the cycle will continue but I also like I think maybe just going straight to bed might not be the best idea but it's the best one I've got right now so it's what I'm gonna do oops <laughs> but anyway thank you guys for watching and I'll see you tomorrow bye